Hi there! I'm Echa Leo Jean. Welcome to my channel. For today's video, ang topic na i-discuss ko ay kung paano ba aayusin yung Gcash verification problem na walang get started button dahil naka-we're verifying pa din yung status na nakalagay sa verification page kahit nakareceive na ng text message from Gcash na rejected na ang application. By the end of this video, malalaman natin yung step-by-step -step guide kung paano ito gagawin at kung ilang days ang aantayin para ma-resolve ito. Kung bago ka pa lang sa aking channel at interested ka sa ganitong klaseng video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell para updated ka sa aking latest video. Nakareceive po kami ng text message from Gcash na hindi na-approve ang aming verification dahil yung ID na napasan namin ay unclear, distorted, at invalid. Kaya magpapasa kami ng panibagong application. Pero nung uulitin namin yung verification process, ang nakalagay pa din sa verification page ay we're verifying your account. Kahit na rejected na ito, at wala pa ding get started button. Kaya hindi kami makapag-reapply for verification. In this video, isi-share ko po kung ano ba yung ginawa namin para maayos ito. First, need muna nating screenshot yung ating verification status na we're verifying your account at walang nakalagay na get started button. Since kailangan natin ito sa pag-follow up ng ating verification. Next, mag-login lang tayo sa ating Gcash account. Pag nasa Gcash account dashboard na tayo, tap lang natin yung profile icon na makikita sa lower right corner ng ating dashboard. Pag nasa profile page na tayo, drag down lang natin hanggang mahanap ang help icon. Then, tap lang natin yung view all articles at magda-direct ito sa Help Center page. Under Product and Services, tap lang natin yung Your Account na icon. Dito sa Your Gcash Account, may lalabas na 6 topics. Yung Get Started with Gcash, Verify Your Account, Account Security, Manage Your Account, Wallet and Transactions, and lastly, yung Manager app. Since ang concern natin is about account verification, ang pipiliin po natin ay yung Verify Your Account. Then, under Verify Your Account, mayroon namang pong 8 articles. Tulad ng Get Fully Verified, List of Valid IDs to Get Fully Verified, Unable to Verify Your Account, Benefits of a Fully Verified Account, how to verify via offline partner at yung failed verification, what to do next. Since ang concern natin ay hindi tayo makapag-reapply for verification dahil naka-we're verifying pa din ang nakalagay sa verification page at wala itong get started button, tap lang natin yung unable to verify your account. Sa article na ito, naka-indicate po dito yung iba't ibang issue regarding account verification. Dito sa concern na we're verifying your account page, tap lang natin yung hyperlink na click here to follow up. Then, magdadirect ito sa submit a ticket form. Naka-auto-fill out na po yung ating email address, Gcash registered full name, country, at mobile number. Next, tap lang natin yung Your Account Type. May 4 choices po na lalabas under Account Type. Piliin lang po natin kung ano ang applicable. Kami po, ang pinili namin ay Regular Account. 
Then, need nating i-provide yung ID submitted for verification. Lalabas po yung list of valid IDs ng GCash for verification. Ang ginamit po namin na ID nung nag-verify ng account ay yung e-fill ID. Since wala ito sa list, tinap ko lang yung others. Then, sa specify here, ilagay lang natin yung e-fill ID. Next, i-input lang natin yung date of last KYC attempt. Para sa mga hindi na maalala yung date, kahit i-estimate nyo na lang po ito. After nyan, i-check lang natin itong screenshot of transaction or error prompt. Then, need naman nating i-input yung details ng ating concern. Ito po yung message na nilagay ko. Hi Gcash, good day. My account verification is already rejected, but I wasn't able to reapply for account verification since the status in verification page is still in where verifying your account. Kindly assist me to fix my concern. I wanted to repeat the verification process. Thank you. After my input yung ating concern, next need naman nating i-attach yung screenshot ng ating verification page na naka-indicate na we're verifying your account. Tap lang natin yung add file or drop files here. Then, magdadirect ito sa ating phone storage. Iselect lang natin yung picture. Antayin lang natin masuccessfully upload yung file na inattach natin. Then, itap lang natin yung submit. After natin masubmit yung ticket, Lalabas po itong GCash confirmation page na we've received your request. Thank you for reaching out to us. We'll get back to you as soon as we can. Para naman po ma-check yung status ng ating submitted ticket sa ating GCash profile page, tap lang natin yung help. Then, itap natin yung your conversations. At itap ang view more. Then, lalabas itong pinasa natin na ticket. Tap lang natin yung arrow right para ma-view ito. After naming mag-submit ng ticket, nakareceive kami ng automated response from GCash na please retry the verification process after 24 hours. Pero, after 24 hours, we're verifying pa din ang nakalagay. At wala pa ding get started button. Kaya nag-submit ako ng follow-up dito sa mismong ticket. Ito po yung message na nilagay ko. Hi, good day. I still can't repeat the verification process after 24 hours. Then, ito naman po yung nareceive ko na response. e, -e enders na daw sa ibang team yung aking concern. At kailangan na namang mag-antay ng another 7 days. After 7 days, nag-check po ako ng verification page. Pero... Verifying pa din ang nakalagay. Kaya nung magpa-follow up na sana ako, hindi ko na makita yung unang ticket na nasubmit ko. Kaya nagpasa na lang ako ng panibago. Nakareceive ulit kami ng automated response na magantay ng 24 hours. Pero after 24 hours, we're verifying pa din ang nakalagay. At wala pa din get started button, kaya nagsubmit ako ng follow up dito sa mismong ticket. Then, within the day, nakareceive ako ng response from GCash. We are glad to inform you that our team was able to deploy the correction needed in order for you to verify your account via GCash app. Kindly perform a clear cache on your mobile device before verifying your account. If the error persists, kindly provide a screen recording video on how you did the process. Nakareceive din po ako ng another update na please try verifying your GCash account. Let me know if you encounter any problems. If there are none and you were able to verify your account, we will resolve this ticket within the next 5 days. After ko mabasa yung response ng GCash, chinect ko agad yung verification page at nawala na nga yung we're verifying your account status. At meron ng get started button Kaya pwede na namin ulitin yung verification process. Actually, hindi ko na nagawang mag-clear cache pero wala naman kaming na-encounter na problem. 
umabot din ng more or less 10 days bago na-resolve ng Gcash etong concern namin. Hopefully, makatulong po yung video na ito para maulit na ang inyong verification process. For more tutorial videos na gaya ng mga nasa screen, you can visit my YouTube channel to watch these videos. Okay, so that's it for today's video. Kung meron kayong questions or clarifications, just comment down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Para naman sa mga mas detailed na questions or concerns, you can reach me sa aking Facebook page at huwag pong kalimutang mag-like at i-follow yung aking page.